All right, today we're going to demonstrate replacing a brake lever. We're going to need an eight millimeter wrench. I'm going to start by disconnecting the brake cable, make it easier to work on. You're going to take your eight millimeter, undo the eight millimeter nut that's sitting underneath here. Set that aside, hold the lever in place while pushing the pivot screw out of the way and then you can pull the whole brake lever assembly off. You'll see that there's a plastic collar on both sides that need to be in place as well as a spring that causes the lever to spring back into position. Now put your put these components on your new lever, come back up to the perch area, make sure the little tab on the spring is seated in the back area and put the whole assembly back into position, making sure it's all lined up with the holes. Take your pivot screw, come back in from the top. Push that through so it goes through both sides. And sits down securely. Take your 10, your eight millimeter nut, put it back on nice and securely, so it's nice and snug. Make sure the lever's got a nice feel and snap back, that means the spring's back into position. Take your cable, put it back into the hole in the lever, pull on it to get it back in the groove, and you're all set. At this point, you want to adjust your rear brake caliper.